Hi everyone, Victor is here. Today I'd like to compare uh, these two inks, Rotring uh, Drawing Ink, that is designed uh, to be used uh, for a Rotring Isograph. Rotring Isograph can be used with these uh, refillable uh, cartridges. And uh, Noodler's Ink, which is uh, uh, ink designed for fountain pens and I'm using uh, it for uh, this Duke uh, bent nib fountain pen it has uh, this uh, refillable uh, piston uh, system both uh, inks are uh, claimed to be waterproof so um, I'd like to compare how fast uh, dries uh, each ink and uh, how fast uh, can I apply uh, water or uh, watercolor on top of uh, each drawing. Let's draw some lines and test for smudginess. This is raw ring ink. I'll draw some parallel lines and uh, with uh, Noodler's ink. Let's wait a few seconds. This is Rotring and this is Noodler's. After a few seconds Noodler's ink still smudges. Let's do another test. We'll draw first Noodler's ink. Then with Rotring. And let's wait uh, longer, let's say for uh, 10 seconds or more. So after 20 seconds, let's see, let's test the noodlers. It still smudges and the rotring it's perfectly dried so obviously rotring ink um, dries uh, much quicker and uh, you can apply uh, right away uh, watercolor or um, water on top of it let's try to do a test with water. Let's test with uh, water. So I'll uh, write something and then I'll wait uh, until it dries. This is rotring. Now let's right with the noodlers. This is the fine point and it doesn't uh, write so uh, well. So I'm trying with the bent nib, noodlers. And let's wait until they dry. Let's see what happens after five minutes. Applying water on rotring ink. Then applying on noodler sink. It seems that noodler sink hasn't dried yet completely. I think um, I think it needs uh, to dry much more time 
than five minutes. Also, what I noticed, if uh, you see on the other page, this is uh, Noodler's ink. Uh, after I applied the uh, water, it seems that uh, it bleeds uh, through. Let's try one other kind of paper. This is Archie's 100% cotton with raw ring. Then we'll draw with the noodlers. And let's wait uh, a couple of minutes to see what happens. So I waited uh, five minutes to dry. Let's uh, try now. Rotring ink. It's water resistant. And let's try noodlers. Again, it smudges and uh, it doesn't seem to be waterproof. Looking again at Noodler's bottle, I see that it says it's bulletproof on cellulose type paper. I'm not sure what bulletproof means. Maybe it's not waterproof. Uh, I tried Noodler's ink uh, on other papers. Um, it's dried, uh, though uh, there were uh, areas that uh, weren't dried completely, but uh, it seems it's not uh, completely waterproof and uh, depends on paper and uh, what uh, time you wait. In conclusion, uh, I think if you want uh, a quicker, uh, uh, faster dry uh, ink, rotring is a better choice. Uh, for Noodler's ink, um, I think you need to wait uh, much longer to, to dry before you apply um, watercolor. So, um, I think uh, uh, for Noodler's ink uh, it was a compromise because it, was, it is designed for um, fountain pens. Maybe this composition uh, uh, requires uh, a longer time to dry. Thank you for watching. Bye!